Science says this is how you catch more fish. So let's get into it. Do the eyes on your fishing lures actually help you catch more bass? Or are they just painted on to catch you? And what about those fake black eye spots on the tail? Are they making your bait look more realistic? Or are they literally causing bass to miss the hook? I dove into three peer-reviewed studies and the science is pretty shockingly clear. Today, you're going to get the real answer. Not myths, no marketing, just data to help you hook more of the fish that bite. All right, let's go. There's an old saying, predators go for the eyes. Turns out, yep, that's absolutely true. In 2024, researchers in Sweden studied yellow perch across 14 lakes. Same species, totally different eye sizes depending on the environment. Now here's what they found. In clearer water, the bait fish had smaller eyes. In open water, where there's open water feeding, they had bigger eyes. And the lakes with more predators, smaller eyes. Now, you wonder why. Well, it's because predators, just like bass, use the eyes of prey to line up a headshot. If your eyes are big, bold, and obvious, you're going to get eaten. And if they're small, subtle, predators miss more often. That's evolution at work, and it tells us a lot about how bass strike our baits. Now, let me ask you a question. You ever see a shad with a fake black dot near the tail or a crankbait with a painted false eye halfway down the body? Scientists in Finland studied this exact trick using artificial prey. They tested no eye spot, a medium spot, and then a big old giant exaggerated spot. And here's the punchline. Predators always attacked the fake eye every single time. And the size didn't matter. Huge eye spot didn't scare anything. Didn't slow them down. Didn't intimidate a single predator. It simply redirected the strike to the wrong end of the prey. That's the entire purpose of a fake eye. Confuse the predator so it strikes the tail instead of the head. Great for bait fish absolutely disastrous for bass anglers. Now, the third study sealed it for me. Australian scientists, and I cannot pronounce their names. I'd have to go back and look at my notes, so please forgive me. But they they raised damselfish under these conditions. Now, I didn't come up with the, the term damselfish. That, that was them. And they did it under three conditions. They did it with predators, with harmless fish, and with no fish at all. After about six weeks, predator exposed fish, only 10% got eaten. The control group, 60% got eaten. That's not theory, that's survival. And it confirms fake eye spots work incredibly well to misdirect predators. And bass are predators. So let's get to the practical fish catching part of all this. Eyes at the head are good. Bass use them to commit to the strike. And they help the fish aim where you want them to aim. Fake eye spots anywhere else is bad news. A fake eye on the side of the tail gives your lure a built-in defense mechanism. Bass strike the wrong end. Bass think the bait will dart the wrong direction. Bass flat out will miss your hook. And if you're running a bait with a big false eye halfway down the body, like a dot way down the, the back on the body, you're basically giving that lure free evasive maneuvers. Scratch it off, paint over it, or grab a different model. In clear water, subtle eyes work better. Matches the prey fish naturally as they evolve. This might be the most practical hack that you hear all year, so please pay attention. If the eyes fall off your bait or the lure comes without any, just put a simple black dot near it. The science shows it doesn't need to be fancy, shiny, or 3D. Bass don't really care. They just need a target. But here's where it gets interesting. Use eye dots to improve wacky rigs, Nikos, and Texas rigs. These rigs always get tail bit. We've all reeled in a worm with teeth halfway down but no hook up, or your worm gets pulled down the shank of the hook. Put a clean, simple black dot right next to the hook. That's now the eye. Think of it as a bullseye that you put on your bait. Bass will attack that spot first, which means more hook and mouth strikes, not tail grabs. I'm testing this heavily this season. And I'm, I'm, I'm betting everything that the research says it should work. And I think it'll work. Bottom line, the science is clear. Bass strike the eye. Fake eyes make predators miss. Eye placement controls your hookup rate. And you can literally fix your baits with a Sharpie. And if you want more science breakdowns like this, check out my new playlist on the channel. And I'll see you on the next one. R.C. Bassin, out.